All right, uh, guys, this is Anton again. <coughs> Feedlot here in Randfontein. Please, please like and subscribe this video. This video is just to show off a bit. This cattle is getting slaughtered in the end of this month. To put a nice steak on your plate. This is Brahman, grey Brahman. It's a beautiful cattle. Look at this white Brahman. Look at bumps. Hey, I'm walking slowly. It's heavy to walk now. This is the famous Boran cattle. It's the worst grower there is. Don't ever put a Boran on your feedlot. This cattle give you 1.4, 1.5 kilograms of growth a day. This is physically the last Boran I'll ever buy. It's terrible. The best one there is, is probably your Bonsmara. This one here. This thing put on weight 2.3 kilograms a day. Look at that body weight. It's a very calm cattle. Very interesting thing that I can demonstrate to you. You can see it. You see that lines on his uh, tail? There's two lines. It's very, very nicely there. I can't come much closer. But that two lines on the tail tell you every line counts for an A. For a, that's an A2 because you've got two lines. Look at this cattle uh, here. Also, he's done with his business. I'll show you the lines on it. It looks like he has three lines. You see the, the stool that comes out is not uh, water, it's nice and solid. <coughs> We need to put down his tail and uh, you will see the, there you can see it, you see got three lines there, it means that's a A3 or a, it's probably an A2 or an A3 cattle. Look how we eat, hey, it's lekker. Another cattle you don't feed is a Dexter cattle, the small one lying here is a Dexter. A lot of people believe heart and soul in a Dexter, but the Dexter cattle is really not a good feeder. Don't, don't buy a Dexter cattle for your, for your feet. Look at this thing. Ah. Look how it's muscled on his body. Look at that back. Look at the shoulders. The front quarter. Look at that front quarter, what it looks like. I'm going to show you the sides. The cattle get divided in five building building uh, sections to get the front quarter, the sides, the top, the, the back and the bumps. What does it look like from the back? Yeah, that's what money looks like. This thing is going to slaughter probably 59, 59%. Look this one. This is also Bonsmara uh, with the muscling. Brahman is champ in a feedlot. Go to Brahman, you will, uh, Bonsmara, you will always be safe. Look that lines on the bum. The small lines here. That lines. <coughs> Look the bum. Beautiful. You can uh, add more months. You can add another month to this, but it's going to become uh, too heavy. This cattle is already going to slaughter over 300 kilograms, so you don't want it too heavy. You want a carcass of about 250, not much higher than that. That white one there is a Ramagnola cattle. Good cattle for the feedlot. It's really not a bad cattle. From of Nola you can add to any feedlot. Look at that bump. Hey. Money, money, money. So yes, I would say a Brahman beef master is one of your best. Simmentaler is one of your best. Limousine.
This is the beast master. Look this one. Yeah, this is the only the only cattle that I would say give a hard time for the for the for the Bons Maras. This thing feed well. Eh? The beef master is champion. The pit lines on the tail. Yeah, you can see it nicely. Look at the lines. The second that you see fat on the tails, that make lines. You know the. <coughs> the cattle is gonna grate. Cement color cattle. Normally, have cement color feet very well. This is a full lead cement color. But this one fit not so bad. Look the lines on the on the tail. But this one can still add. This this cattle is not free. Can still add a hundred kilograms to this carcass. Look at this promo. Yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful. This one's name is Buffalo. It's a pity to know that this cow is getting slaughtered in the end of this month, this calf. It's already time. This is another Bonsmara cattle. If I can give any man advice in terms of uh, buying cattle, go Bons Mara, you'll never be disappointed. Bons Mara is the best. I would say best is Bons Mara and second beef master. Very calm temperament. <coughs> it's not an aggressive cow, it's easy in the neck lamp to handle it, to inject. Look the eyes, it's far apart. See the eyes. This is some mixture. It's probably a bit of Drakensberg or something in there. Another interesting factor is you see these lines. Then if you can see that lines, horizontal lines on the side on these rib guys, that that lines even in uh, cattle that walk in the felt. That lines tell you that uh, this cattle is healthy. It doesn't need anything. If you got that lines, you see that one also got the lines on his rib case. <coughs> you see that, that the calf is healthy. This doesn't need much. Yeah, this thing is round. Eh? Look at that body. It's flat on top. Also bones Mara. Stunning, stunning, stunning. See the lines on the bump. Look at bump. I think this is probably the heaviest one in the crawl, this beef monster. There's the sun setting. Time to go go home. This thing is also a bit of a Boran Brahman cross. Brahman is good, so Brahman is not bad, but Boran is terrible. Don't believe all these gimmicks that Cyril Ramaphosa buy Boran. He's talking nonsense, it's a gimmick. You can put a Boran on a feedlot and see how you lose money. It doesn't work, Boran cannot feed. Do the same than a Dexter, one and a half kilos a day. <coughs> This thing's this carcass here be 2.2, 2.3 kilos a day for the same feed. Give me one logic re reason why you want to feed it boar on cattle. 